What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. Chantal, I know you love horror movies, so do you want to play a game? Let's play a game. Let's play a game where two years you haven't driven. You can then go wherever you want. All the fresh food, all the options, just yours. Prime for the taking. I want you to think about that while we go through this video. Because Chantal goes through the normal hellos. She's sitting in the car saying she's starving. She's been shopping today. She's not comfortable driving alone, being alone. She shouldn't be out. It's a Saturday after all. She did a vlog in the mall. And now she went to Hardy's. Hardy's. Salah is busy with, quote, work stuff. But ironically enough, he shows up in the chat relatively quickly. And she's not sure about her parking situation. She complains about how hectic the drive was. She worries at some point while she eats, she's going to be told to move. You know, these are all issues you're going to have when you don't know the language, can't read the signs, don't really understand anything going on around you. She's also unaware of how this car functions, which I really am astonished by. She was saying she had been driving this car by herself multiple times. She doesn't seem to understand how to get it locked, how to get it unlocked, how to start it. You know, the order we didn't hear much of because she forgot the router in the car. So there was a lot of pixelated images and garbled sound. We heard extra mayonnaise. We heard Diet Coke. We clearly get a massive cup of Chipotle sauce. Now, Sala goes from so busy and working to being in the chat in less than 12 minutes. And we'll get to him at the end of this. But it's just interesting to me the way she almost yells at the car, the complaining about the heat. How within 15 minutes of the stream, she's eating. The chat tells her, you know, she doesn't know a lot for someone that's driving there. They tell her, how can you not understand turning the car on and off? She starts to get anxious. She starts to get nervous. You see that when there's people around her, she has to move her whole body from side to side just to look outside. And then, of course, she starts to get into reaction channels. And a lot of it, a lot of it is Sam and Yaba. I mean, honestly, she also defends all the channels that she loves, but everyone that she doesn't love is just scum. She's coming for all our channels. It truly does amaze me. This image right here, Manny is all over her face, cup of sauce in one hand, burger in the other. You know, this should be bliss. This should be glee. This should be happy. You know, this is Chantal having fun. Are we really to a point where going and being out on our own and getting anything she wants? In this case, chicken tenders, fries, burger. Look at that face. Does that face look sad? Because it, it is by the end of the video. Chantal, if this isn't going to make you happy, then honestly, I don't know what is. And she turns this into this elaborate, you know, just sit back and wait and be patient. Chantal, here's the thing. I'm going to let you in on a secret. The channels that you watch that don't like reactors, they don't care about you. And they certainly don't care about your channel. Right? They let you see segments of clips. And then you assume that that's all that people do. So you can go down this path of, oh, I'm going to get this person's channel taken down. Oh, this person breaks terms of service so many times. Chantal, Chantal, you, you have lost your channel. Remember, you got it right back before Cuba. Remember how excited you were? You and Pete's gave us the double bird. So some of the channels that you sit there and kind of clap your hands with, they didn't even cover you back then. Are you that hungry for a friend, for an ally? I mean, you've got your Beezers here, right? The GoPro is sitting beside you. You made a vlog. Right? And rather than sit there and talk about all the fun things that you're going to do or all the adventures you're going to have or how, you know, being able to drive is going to unlock all this freedom, even if you really drove down the block again, we'll, we'll get to that. But for someone that sits there and so proudly proclaims that all everyone else does is rage and stay angry. I mean, you seem pretty content carrying on this way. And you double down on it. You're literally sitting here after eating all this food and saying, oh, you know, I'm going to get the FBI involved. 
I'm going to go back to these people, to those people, to that person, to this person, Chantal. Again, you are not the innocent party here. I know that you think you are. I know it make you, make, makes you feel better, but it's really not accurate. So that's essentially what happened. Eating and anger. I think that pretty much fills in a lot of Chantal's videos. But I, I did mention I wanted to get into a couple things here at the end, because some of the things in the chat I was really, really intrigued by. And, and it starts with the owner-CEO of Vandalay Fragrance, an international juggernaut in scent. You know, he's in here basically encouraging it. You know, our channels are coming to an end. Right? We're breaking terms of service. The FBI will start their work. Sala, is this you? Is this you really talking about the FBI? Really? Okay. Okay, but you know what? I, I don't want to be disingenuous. It's not just Sala. You know, it's other people in the chat. I, I, I'm going to be honest. I don't believe this is, I don't believe this is rarity. The missing cat. I don't think cats have opposing thumbs to type, but uh, I mean, again, like the sentiment here and all of this, Chantal, all of this is designed. All of this is designed to fire you up. You know, just read this comment and consider the source. I mean, again, you know, are you trying to help Chantal or are you trying to hinder Chantal is the question. Because so many of the people in this chat were loving the fact that she was raging. You know, my next video, right? My next video is going to be about her getting her Kuwait license and then raging in a parking lot. Uh, I would ask Jonah Fork, what would you like it to be about? Because that's exactly what happened. I, I recap her videos and, and that's what she did. And apparently you, you were there loving every second of this, were you not? It's astonishing to me that for what it's worth, Everyone pretends that they want Chantal to be better and do better and feel better, but they're the first ones in line to sit there and champion her doing all of these things that they know are not beneficial to her. You know, and here we again deal with Salah talking about money. Oh, Salah, if only you knew some of the things you missed out on before you were in the picture. I'm sure reaction channels will show you. But just to give you an idea of how much Chantal lives this, I mean, absolutely lives this. Tonight, there was a lot of discussion about where this Hardee's is located. And Bad Seed actually posted where Chantal may have went. And you can see that this gets posted, so convenient, right around the corner, which it, it could be. I don't know. And I really don't care. You know, I understand the thought process that maybe Chantal didn't drive there. Maybe Sala parked the car there and then ran over to the red, I mean, back to the apartment and then, you know, got online and then they did it. But within minutes, within minutes, Chantal, what are you doing? This. This is your life online and online, meaning you don't have an offline. When you're taking people to go eat with you, when you're looking forward to going out to eat more than anything else, you lose the ability to talk about other people and say they don't have lives or they don't do things because we see what makes you happy. And clearly you're to a point where even that isn't working anymore. Love to know your thoughts on this. Appreciate you watching it. Top comments from the last video. And you know, just like Chantal ordering extra sauce at a Hardee's, there's no way that I will not be back soon as I can with more commentary.